Hey guys, and welcome back to Halo Wars. When we last left off, we were defending, uh, well, we finished defending Arcadia, getting the population out, then we counter-attacked and uh, destroyed an enemy base with a load of Spartans, which was fun. Now, we've been informed that, uh, <clears throat> that there's a, a problem which is uh, frustrating somebody so let's go and sort this out so if we go to campaign uh we're not going to do that one we're going to go to missions and we're going to go to dome of light strategic placement of spirit fires rhinos help bring down uh the covenant energy dome a covenant super weapon is now vulnerable to attack okay yeah so uh interesting stuff one thing that i don't like about games for windows um 10 whatever you want to call them these days is when you unlock an achievement it pops up but it pops up in the background behind the game in your windows taskbar um, I really don't like that. I, th I wish um, there should be an integrated UI for games for Windows Live, like the Xbox, so you could check controller power and all that kind of stuff if you're using a controller power, uh, control pad. Um, there are plenty of games that are better with a control pad. Um, this is not one of them. Uh, and it should pop up with achievements and friends and all that kind of notification, like the old system used to work for the old 360 games. Uh, I have been trying to work out how to check your achievements without going through a load of bullshit on Windows 10 games. Um, and I just thought, oh, yeah, I guess maybe the achievements don't pop up at all. Until I was playing this earlier and my laptop that's next to me um, actually was sitting on the on, on Windows 10 desktop popped up with an achievement for this game. So I was like, okay, so the achievements are popping up behind the game. That is absolutely, completely useless. Uh, I, I hope they integrate a better system than that, because that, that's a fucking joke, Microsoft. Anyway, let's go to Dome of Light. So, it's an energy shield that they can deploy on the planet. Yes, Captain. We can't see through it, but the Covenant are up to something. Agreed. We need to find out what that is. Can we use the ship's cannons and take it out directly? We may destroy whatever's under there. Covenant shield technology is susceptible to superheated plasma. Aren't we field testing some plasma-based rhinos? Pillar of Autumn inventory shows they have some prototypes. It may take some time to get the right power settings. I'll need to be on the ground to do that. Professor, Sergeant Forge, let's get that shield down. Ah, babysitting again? Mm-hmm. Well, well that was a coincidence. Anders, is there anything out here except for that huge alien dome thing? Scans seem clear. Shall we see what's inside? I think we should. That's quite an advanced human vehicle. A plasma. Ooh, doesn't look like it fires Looks plasma. Looks like we only shook the beehive. We got multiple bogeys incoming. Well, that was unfortunate. All right, let's go to work. Ah, this level has some great music. So, kill the approaching Covenant infantry. We can do that with the help of our Spartans. Yep. We have Alice, Douglas, and Jeremy. Not bad. I'm sure she's got loads. Go collect the resources. This mission is quite something. It's basically a holdout mission, um, more or less. But it's quite a fun one. On the way. All right, first thing we need is to tech up. On the move. We have a squad of men. We've got two squads of men here. Right, so let's take this. Come on, boys. Hoss it. Get their loopy asses in there. Excellent. Now, unfortunately, this is the only base we can build in this area. So to cut down on how many buildings we, we need, we can take this place over, which gives us a free plus one to our tech. 
And there's another one down here. Moving out. Yes, sir. Which is excellent. So now we can start upgrading our supply pads straight away. Okay, now to unlock the skull on this mission, we need to destroy 50 ban uh, banshees. Which is, you know, just a matter of time. Okay, so we've got some decent level tech now. Get in there, Forge. Stop being such a pansy. Come on, Alice. Alice is my favourite, because she's got the Gatling gun. So she's not really equipped to take out infantry. Uh, to, to take out infantry. Oh, she eats infantry for breakfast. She's not really equipped to take out vehicles. Uh, Jeremy here has a Spartan laser, so he's just fucking badass against everything. And Douglas, uh, he has the rocket launcher, so he's quite good against vehicles, but limited application against infantry. Alright. Your orders, buddy, are to collect all this stuff. Let's keep Upgrading our supply pads. Resources are going to be quite slow to start with in this mission. There we go. Now, if we request rhinos, they cost us money, but they do not uh, take up our pop cap. I don't think. Alright, this is going quite nicely here. And we need to decide whether we want to focus on infantry or vehicles. Uh, it's not a hard decision, to Reactor be honest. Uh, we're going to focus on vehicles. Infantry are good. But, you know, vehicles are much better. Fortress upgrade complete. Right, cool. So Enemy we're going to get the field armory. And we'll get a vehicle bay. And then we're pretty much ready to roll. I do like the fact that we can see uh, Anders in here. On, yeah. That's a nice bit of detail. Enemy Very cool. Engagement. Oh, I see. Rolling out. That's not going to fly. Enemy engagement. All right, they're not. They shouldn't be too hard at the moment, and they're only going to be probing us. Rolling out. All right, let's grab those things there. Field armory complete. Mm, nice. We need to get some turrets up. Get rid of these bloody pesky banshees. Which are going to be a constant pain in our ass. On the way. Yeah. Base under attack. They're going to be a problem for some time. We'll upgrade them for missiles. Let's move. That should Rolling. swap these flies. Let's these go. troublesome Field flies. Complete. There we go. Got some vehicles. Complete. Now, let's get some Wolverines. More resources required. Come on. Wolverines are great. They're basically uh, missile trucks. God damn, it takes turrets so long to build. I actually always forget about that. Uh, let's can't get the second gen yet. We could use a bigger pop cap, but not just yet. Alright, you Enemy engagement. keep looking for resources, because we need all of the resources. Out. Nothing up there. Alright, RTB, buddy. Mm-hmm. Damn right, Marines. Right, let's keep our Wolverines back. They are kind of squishy, and they're not great against infantry, but against vehicles and uh, aircraft... They uh, eat them for breakfast, but as I said, extremely squishy. Let's press forwards. We can fortify the Spartans, but there's no point. I'm just better off keeping them in a group. Um, let's get one more of those. Ah. Turrets are ready to go. Let's get missile packs. Turret complete. Nice. So that's uh, nearly 10 banshees gone already. Excellent. Oh yeah, we need Turret to upgrade improved. that as well. Turret improved. Nice. These will Turret improved. pretty much be able to handle the banshees on their own now. Come on. 
you can see how uh, troublesome this is financially for us. But once we've researched everything we need here, we can get rid of that. There we go. Max tech level engaged. Let's go. Right, let's scout out. Oh, I was wondering what that bar did. On the way. See, it wouldn't even be so bad if that bar brought down some kind of achievement system Reactor so we can track approved. it and whatnot. But you. Base under attack. The only way to track achievements and whatnot is by tabbing out of the game. Which I just think. I really think that's silly. PCs should be at the forefront of the UI and all that kind of stuff. But um, the consoles have got it nailed down. And Microsoft has no excuse with the. Uh, with the Xbox One and all that. We're not really going to need Cobras here, but we are going to need Scorpions. We need that Reserves. Reserves is really good. Makes our units train a lot quicker. On the move. On the way. Let's, Let's move. see if we can find some more supplies. Yeah, we can't. That's not Let's good. Roll. Let's go. That's a shame. We could really use the supplies. On the move. Never mind. Okay. Come on, forge. Old iron balls. Right, here we are. That's quite nice. You can fortify all of these buildings, but again, there's no real point. Ah, more stuff down here. As you can see, our Spartans are just eating everything for breakfast right now, which is nice. Um... Could use the extra pop cap, but we don't need it yet. Enemy I suppose the sooner that. we research all of this stuff, the sooner we can sell it and get. Um, let's get the volley ability. Reserve. Then after Research. that, we can get quite a nice upgrade. Um, go for medium turrets. So we need our turrets to hold. The fort whilst we're away because we have to spread our forces fairly thin on this mission. It's where a population cap really um, is a bit of a pain to be honest. But then I never really like population caps in games. In my strategy games. Other things I don't like include um, limited resources. That's one reason why I can't get into StarCraft. I hate the, the fact that we have limited resources. Once you mine all the gas and mine all of the crystals, you're fucked. Moving out. It's the same reason, uh, well, the same roll. thing that bugged me with Warcraft, to be Holy honest. Research. It's really kind of annoying. Under attack. Now, let's come roll. back down here. Yeah, they're really not. Uh, we're getting upgrade. past our defenses. Yes, now we've got the next level of turrets. Might as well get that one and that. Resources required. Damn it. We don't really need adrenaline. We're not going to be using... Oh, hang on. It does say all infantry units to run a significant... I wonder if that means Spartans as well. Well, I guess we're going to find out. Alright, we're almost built up. I do love these Wolverines. As you can see... Their rockets do not mess around. Suit it up. Suit me. I suppose, really, just to give us a better. Nah, I don't like splitting them up. That's the thing. Because these Spartans all have quite varied weapons. You've got anti infantry, anti vehicle, and then anti everything. It is best to keep them all in one. In one group. I mean, you can split them up. It's totally viable, but. I don't really see the point. Lovely. Research. Nice. So, oh, are we good to go? Once we get that, we're good to go. We'll get the adrenaline. Cue that up as well. Right, okay, there we go. Dual launchers. This thing's cool. I'm not really sure how the dual launchers work, to be honest. I don't know if it makes them fire missiles faster, which makes sense, or whether their damage output is just higher, because they fire missiles, or they probably fire twice the volley, that makes sense. Good night. 
Don't like that turret being that damaged. I'm also not... A, one thing I was never a huge fan of is the healing dome. I wish that there, there was a different way in this game of healing. Because obviously it cools down and you have to pay for it. Alright, so we've got the max level turrets now. I am going to save before we recycle that because I don't know if it actually works like that. If we can comfortably recycle everything. Uh oh. And still keep all the tech. We should be able to. His shield's almost down. Now remember, Spartans can't die. And these ones can't, anyway. The hero ones. Once they fall down, you just have to pick them back up again. Just like any hero unit. Jackals are a pain in the ass. Jackal snipers. Also, check out how long it takes his shield to recharge. That's interesting. If you get close enough to them, you can usually hear the fact that their shields are... There we go. Hear that shield sound. Adrenaline Love it. Research. Uh, yeah, if you get close enough to them, you can usually hear the buzzing or the beeping of their so uh, shield failing. Right. Are you sure? Yes. Okay, there we go. Enemy engagement. That's cool. I was hoping it would work like that. Right, let's get another supply pad in here. And let's start upgrading. Uh, how many Wolverines do we have? We've got three. Let's get one more Wolverine. And then more resources required. we just fill up on uh, Scorpions because we're going to need as many as we can get our grubby little mitts on. And there's not really anything to explore here. Supply pad. Alright, let's build that up. Could probably recycle. Oh! Didn't actually uh, upgrade that one. No wonder resources are coming in slowly. Supply pad Excellent! Upgraded. Make them pay. Supply pad upgraded. Yes, nice. There we go. So we're running at our maximum supply potential now. Cool. Come on. The la the dual launchers do look dual quite cool in these. Research. Look much better. Much more intimidating. Much meatier. Uh, so one more Wolverine. There's no point in building... Um, I mean, I guess we could upgrade the Warthogs and whatnot, but they're kind of pointless, really. It's just a waste of resources. Alright, there we go. Got all the Wolverines we're ever going to have. Unless one gets destroyed, obviously, but we're we're hoping that it does not get destroyed. Almost got enough banshees to unlock the skull, which is nice. Get out of my air zone, you bastards! So no alien zone, no UFOs allowed. Though well, technically they're not UFOs. I mean, they're definitely identified. All right, let's get the canister shell ability because that's ridiculously useful. Look at all those missiles. The main enemy attack is going to come from here. And they're going to be dropping in troops. So we need this place to be fortified. Okay. Alright, let's get the canister. I don't think... Oh yeah, we can get one other upgrade for the scorpions. Suppose, really, what we could do... Once our tech level has maxed out, we could probably recycle that, to be fair, once we've researched everything that we're going to research. Again, Gorse Cannon we could get, but there's no point. We're not going to be building any anymore. Warthogs are cool, but they're so fragile. Just got to play the waiting game. Forge has uh, seen better days. There we go. Let's get everything healed up. It's a shame this has to cool down. I mean, I get it. You could spam it. Um, but 
I just wish you could build like a repair unit. Cannons to shell, and we get the power turret, which makes the turret rotate quicker. What does it actually say about that? Doubles the rotation speed for scorpion turrets, making them considerably more responsive in combat. Hardened steel plates give the cobra extra protection when locked down. <laughs> Hardened steel plates. We're like 500 Enemy odd engagement. years into the future here. And they're still using hardened steel. No wonder we're losing the war. Enemy engagement. These guys must be uh, getting quite hard. Base under attack. It's only going to be a banshee. Nothing to worry about. Right, how are we doing? Almost there. I don't know if these actually change upgrade when the when they get the upgraded turrets. Power turret. Reset. Oh yeah, yeah they do. That's cool. Alrighty, right. Let's just pump these guys out now. More resources required. Enemy engagement. And then we can attack. make start making progress on our objective. Look at that. Look at the sheer amount of fire. Although these turrets are pretty bad. They're not as powerful as you hope they would be. Unfortunately. Right, let's get our first rhino deployed. Harvest surface command, pillar of autumn. Request for plasma rhino is approved. Rhino is inbound. The rhino has arrived. Get it to position one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know what we're doing. Right. Let's roll, gentlemen. Let's roll. Unfortunately, they have just... Unleashed loads of men on us. Uh oh. Avoid the hot plasma. Now, rhinos you can use as an effective fighting unit in this game. They are hella powerful. I don't think we get them very often, though. Once they get to their location and are deployed, we lose them. They become under Anders' control. I'll take control of that rhino to calibrate the shots. Yeah, you do that. Scorpion rolling out. Right, okay. They will not. Yeah. Yeah, so here come the ODST. ODSTs are awesome. You basically get these guys for free. Okay, so. Oh, lovely. We have some coffee scum. Right where you mark. Yeah, tell me We're about it. Take that out first. Right, you guys hang back and protect this. Yes, sir. This is a job. Yes, I'm there. This is a job for the scorpions. For Two scorpions attack. should be able to handle it. Although the pathing here is doesn't really work overly well. How many scorpions have we got? We've got plenty. Okay. Although three will do this. Right. Let's roll these guys over. Canister shells. Canister ability is brutal. I love it. Then who doesn't love seeing aliens get fried? Honestly. Scorpions are also quite effective at anti-air. They're better than you would realistically give them credit for anyway. Let's cut these guys down. There we go. Alright, let's roll at their base. Now these are going to constantly call in reinforcements, which is absolutely unacceptable. You better run, you bastard. Turn around and shoot you in the back then. Alright, one down. Oh god, look at all these guys. Look at all these banshees. We must have destroyed enough banshees actually to unlock the skull. Right, roll up guys. Now we do need to check back every now and again. To make sure our rhinos aren't too heavily damaged. You can repair the rhinos, obviously. But there's also, I think, a, an achievement for not losing any of them. 
Which, as long as you're vigilant, isn't too hard. Right, let's... The area is secure. Get a rhino in place. Already on it, Forge. Already on it. Right, we have pretty much Enemy all the engagement. technology. Rhino, ready to rock. That we need. Right, let's get this rhino to where it needs Enemy to be. Oh, wow. Okay. Enemy engagement. Things got pretty bad over here. Locking down. Regeneration healing target. Right, let's get that healed. These guys aren't gonna survive. Moving up. Fueled up and rolling. Which is not acceptable. We need our guys to survive. Because we do not want to lose that. Come on, man. Come on. Right. Base under attack. Come on. Don't Take lose that. There we go. Good work, man. Held the ground pretty well. There's only like one of them left. Deflection They're only two levels. Research. Only level two. That takes so long. Right. You guys hold that area. Come on. Right. Okay. What ebbs, yo? What ebbs? Piercing shot? Why not? Where's the rhino? Yeah, they they do find it hard to path to this place. Let's get two rhino, uh, two scorpions here to hold this place, protect the rhino. They will call in ODST as well, but ODSTs they're just infantry. That one's quite badly damaged. Not much effect, but it looks like we're making some progress. Unfortunately, we woke the hornet's nest. If we can bring these dropships down on their way in. Yes, that's it. Keep that going. I've marked the third position. Beautiful work, man. Beautiful work. All about positioning. Right, let's heal this rhino up. So we need to get a rhino over there. Okay, that's problematic. Good stuff, man. Good stuff. Right, let's order another rhino. We'll have that rhino on the ground in no time. We need... We're going to need a transport to get the rhino to that position. Oh, you think? Pull it up. You thought about that all by yourself. Ready. I am wondering. Enemy engagement. Right, might get away of just sending one scorpion. Fueled up and rolling. Yeah, I think we'll get away with just using one scorpion here. We're ready. Okay. Because there inbound. isn't a huge amount set. of opposition over here. I mean, there's enough. Is a go. But it's not a huge issue. There we go. I wonder if that's foe hammer in there. Enemy engagement. Right. Ready. Let's regen these men. Foe Hammer was, of course, in the original game. Yes, look at that. Then just not breaking through. We literally control the skies. Oh, that one. That one. Managed to get through, but that's not the end of the world. Good enough. Right, let's bring you over there. You need to come down here and collect the black box. Which should be situated just up here. There we go. There we go. Number six. Not quite a synchronized shot, but we'll take it. Oh. Yeah. Locusts suck. Locusts are nasty bits of work, but eh. They might have locusts. But we have serious hardware of our own. Come on. Get in there. There we 
Have a good. Our calculations show that two more rhinos will be necessary to open a hole big enough. The final two positions have been marked. All right, you got it. You asked, so you shall have. Already at max. Crack the up. must have figured out what we're doing. We're going to need a larger force to take those locations. Yeah, trouble is, Forge, we don't have a larger force. Because for some reason, uh, we have a population cap. Enemy engagement. We'll have that rhino on the ground in no time. At least our base is solved. Solved? Yeah. The problem at the base is solved. I know what I meant. Nice. <laughs> Suicidal. Suicidal, uh. Enemy engagement. Covenant. I love it. How are we doing over here? Does anyone need healing? Yeah, you do. Ready to go. Let's drop some heals over here for these guys. What are you like? You're good. You're good. You're good. You're pretty damn good. Alright. Everything's fine. Alright, let's get this rhino in. Not you, you silly idiots. Where's the rhino? Uh, have I? Oh! Rhino's leading the charge. I admire your enthusiasm, rhino, but uh, please don't. Oh, hello. Trying to be sneaky. Oh, see that shrapnel fly. Mm-hmm. I like it. Yes, sir, I like it. All right, let's fry these guys. Yeah, we don't need to... Go to the spirit of fire powers. We're good. Damn grunts. Wow, this place is putting out um, hunters. Which is not great. Let's not sugarcoat anything here. Snipers at the back. Ooh, locusts. No way am I having locusts. Although, I'd say the hunters are slightly more dangerous. Now, we can't build any kind of air support on this level, sadly. I can't believe how slow the, um, the scorpion starts uh, rotate, actually. It's kind of interesting. Right, we need two volunteers. But before we get some volunteers, heal up. Now you locate, relocate to there. Makes sense. Oh, you're really badly damaged. How's everything doing over here? We're good. Only one more rhino to get into position. Enemies are all under control. Unfortunately, when they crash land, they always get their men out, which is a little bit cheaty, but uh, it's okay. We'll accept it. Right. You hold that. Well, the last men make the push. We don't have any more vehicles. As you can see, we pretty much spread our units out to our limit. Enemy engagement. Yeah. It's not too bad. Right. Let's get another rhino. Rhino LRA plasma augment on its way. Rhino. It's a shame really you can't get uh, see what the normal rhinos are like. Here we go. At least I don't think you can get the normal rhinos. Now well, that ghost is ducking and weaving like a champion, sadly. It's not uh, gonna be good enough. Let's get the regen going on this. Give these guys a little bit extra hand. That looks more like a plasma gun now. You better run. Enemy engagement. All 
Oh, you guys are gonna get hosed. Enemy engagement. All right, let's push up and attack. Shouldn't take too long to sweep these guys out. Really, grunt squad. Ridiculous. Rhino, ah, sugar. That's not that good. Come on. Don't really want to lose any. Come on. Yeah, they're good. Doesn't matter if we lose any of those. All right. There we go. Let's get that rhino powered up. Okay. Now, one thing we do need, we need Forge to go collect the skull for us. Which is just here. Going. Sneakily hidden behind your base. Rhino, roll up. We've got the skull sickness. Now, as far as I remember, sickness is base a, under attack. Uh, makes your units fifty percent weaker, which is not great, but it also increases Enemy your engagement. score. So, I guess it swings and roundabouts. How much health does that rhino have now? Almost max. I'm there. Doesn't matter anyway, because we've basically won. Rhino, get your ass in there, boy. Wow, look at that. Level 3 veterancy. Oh, no. Son of a Cross your fingers. Firing all rhinos in three, two, one. These guys are having a field day. Right, fingers crossed, guys. The dome power supply is overloaded. We got it. It's a good thing we had these uh, rhinos in our back pocket, isn't it? Single turret Ooh, single turret available. Well, we've only got 40 rounds. Do as much damage as we possibly can. All right. The dome generators and air defenses are the main target. Light them up. Away. This is fun. 40 mac rounds. I like it. Massive, massive railgun. Makes you feel like a man. Can we catch that? Oh, I was hoping to catch that. Couldn't quite. Hmm. So there we go. 33 minutes. Not too bad. So punch the hole and scoop the meat. Uh, what have we got here? Gold medal, which is nice. We got the skull and we got the box. Quite happy with that. Right. Anyway. Anyway, guys. When we come back, we're going to go uh, and have a little poke around and see what those cobby scum were up to. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, until next time.